How to clean a vacuum. Sometimes the dirtiest things in the house are the things that we use to clean it. Constant exposure to dirt and grime can make the vacuum cleaner a breeding ground for disease and bad odors. Though it might look daunting, cleaning the vacuum should not take long. There are a lot of parts to clean, but not all of them need to dealt with every time you spruce up your vacuum. Performing a basic cleaning. Read the vacuum's instructions. There is a lot of variability between vacuums. Before cleaning yours, read the instructions for directions on how to break apart and clean your vacuum. Unplug the vacuum. It can be hazardous to apply water to the vacuum when it is plugged in. None of these steps should be executed while the vacuum is plugged into an outlet, even if it is turned off. Take apart the vacuum cleaner. You will need to be able to reach around all the insides of the vacuum to clean it up. Remove the canister and take the filter out. Break down any moving parts that can be deconstructed. Empty the canister. Open the canister and drop the insides into a garbage bag. Consider performing this outside or in the garage to avoid spreading dust or dirt around your house. You might need to shake the canister to help jostle some of the dirt out of it. Wet a cloth. Wet a microfiber cloth. Apply a little bit of all-purpose cleaner or vinegar mix to the cloth. Squeeze the cloth to remove all excess moisture. Wipe down the vacuum. Use the cloth to rub down the outside and the inside of the canister. Wipe down all parts of the vacuum that are accessible, including the cord and the outside of the hose. Do not, however, apply moisture to the plug itself or any other electrified components. Wash the filter. The filter is generally at the top of the canister and is one of the most important parts of the vacuum. Remove it from the canister and run cold water over it. Do not use soap. Let water run through it until no more dirt or grime is coming off. Allow everything to dry in a warm spot for a day. It is particularly important that you not reinsert components of the canister, like the filter, until they have dried. Putting moist objects in a confined space can encourage the growth of bacteria. Leave the vacuum out in the sun, if possible.